Do not stray. Don't stop here. Move along. An older member is within our reach, Basim. And like those before and those yet to come, Al Ghul's death will be just. This is a man who prays after desperate and the disenfranchised. And such atrocities will only continue. For Al Ghul is but a cog in a larger wheel. One that spins destructively. So long as it does, we hidden ones will make it our mission to slow it to a stop. Today, you will lend your hand, your blade, to that very mission. And while Al Ghul is your first target, he will not be your last. I have great belief in that, and in you. Through all my stoicism, my harsh lessons, know that you have impressed me, Basim. The Order's presence in Baghdad and beyond rests on shifting sands so long as you remain at the tip of our spear. And that is where I intend to remain, beholden to your guidance, Master. As busy as a beehive. Come, set your sights on the trial that I win. Merchants, livestock, caravans from all walks. And I thought Anbar's markets were disorderly. Where there is disorder, there is chaos. And chaos can bring opportunity. See what avenues present themselves. Be reactive, but patient. And trust your instincts. That is Mas'ud, on the balcony, just as Ali described. I see him. Go now, wet it with the blood of the slain. I will find you when it is over. You think your cruelty is well hidden, Al Ghul. For you chose those with little voice whose cries you knew would go unheard. They dug at your bidding died at your hand, and were cast away like so much refuse. All to scour the desert for some artifact. Even now you haggle for flesh, safe in the Karwan Sarai. You prefer your victims chained and starved. It is time you faced a man unbound. Come, the stage is yours, Basil. The fire has caused Rockus an alarm. Let us get a wider view. What is the delay? Not I am welcome welcome here. here. Some oh. cards came. What delays your departure, friend? Someone by the name of Mas'ud saw fit to inspect my wares. And so here I wait. Who does he think he is? What is it you are carrying? I ask only so that I may collect it for you. Would you do that? I would take great joy in seeing that man in a fit of anger. It is a crate of silks and spices. Ready your camel. I will see what I can do. If I can get that merchant to leave, his abrupt departure may lure Al Ghul out. We will be here until next
spices and silks. There cannot be too many of those around. A strange thing to happen upon. Perhaps I can use this to my advantage. Those two men are having a loud dispute, but not loud enough. How might I push them over the edge? What? What the? Hmm. Pungent. This must be the caravan merchant's crate. Hmm. Pungent. This must be the caravan merchant's crate. Is that what I think it is? Is this your crate? Ah, it is indeed. The guards returned it to you. In a manner of speaking. Very good, very good. I must repay you. You seem like a man who enjoys a good meal. Care for some spice? Not today, no. But I will ask that you loudly proclaim your departure. Make sure Masoud notices. <laughs> we share the same mind. My thanks to you, ya sadiqi. I'm <laughs> sorry. 
Keep calm. Word will show him get to the Come out and inspect him. Coward. There he is. My customers always now is my chance. Wearing satisfied smiles and still heavy belts. This ends now. Turn your hate inward, Masoud. It is your wickedness that has led you here. Wickedness? To whom? The unenlightened? The feeble who have cast their lot? It is our divine will to rule over them. Our duty to exact their contribution. Contribution? To what? To what could be. The very knowledge of which lies buried beneath these sands. Some things are meant to stay that way. No, 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 no. These are gifts destined to be recovered. They speak to us, as you well know. Me? Oh, yes. The hidden one you may be. But not just. Clear your mind. Al Ghul's relentless pursuit at the expense of human lives has come to an end. It is a day of victory, not only for those spared of his cruelty, but for the hidden ones. The Order's grand plot in Baghdad may still be a mystery, but we can at least be certain Al Ghul's role in it has been vanquished. I believe what he sought to uncover were more strange objects, like the one I took from the Winter Palace. What does the Order want with these relics of the past? And why guard them with so much effort? You are beginning to ask the right questions, Basim. We shall find the answers together. 
Lately, all I have are questions. What do you mean? Nothing. Forget I said anything. How am I to guide you if you will not speak openly? I have... I have... struggled with nightmares. In these dreams, a jinni torments me until I wake up panicked and soaked with sweat. In Alamut, I had nearly forgotten about it. But when I killed Alol, I felt its presence again. And I am left asking why? Why here? Why now? Why me? Piling questions and no answers. I meant to tell you, but... You were afraid I would think you weak of mind. We are only as weak as we allow ourselves to be. To shed a weakness, you must do what is necessary to mend that which causes you pain. Will you permit me a brief respite? I wish to seek out an old friend. Niha? I remember. She is important to you, isn't she? She is. But last we spoke, I led her to believe otherwise. This causes you pain. Then go and heal this wound without delay. Find me at the Harbia Bureau when it is settled. If that was indeed Nihal, I have not a clue where she went. Back home in Anbar, maybe. <laughs> <laughs>